Hello folks and welcome back to Ravenport 22. As you see we are being a little bit busy. We've just been finishing off the spraying of our field so we got the fertilizer almost done and there's still quite a bit of weed work to do. So if we have the car of weeds. So yeah we've got all that to do. Got this section here to finish off and these sections up here. But yeah, what I'm going to do is finish off all of the fertilizing and why did I leave that there? That must have been from several episodes ago when I was doing something that, but you know, let's get rid of that. But yeah, so what we need to do, fertilizing just like a little bit over there needs to be done, everything else to be done. But yeah, I'm not going to really sweat over small stuff. But yeah, we really need one of these machineries now, so what I'm going to do is sell those. And yeah, what I'm going to be doing in this episode, as I can tell by the title and thumbnail, along with what we discussed in the last episode earlier on, well, earlier on today as I'm recording this, yeah, we are going to be purchasing every production on the map, so we start by producing, or purchasing the bakery now, I think it was, was it? So yeah, the bakery. I need quite a bit of items. We're getting apples and that sent over. Strawberries are stocking up. But we need milk, sugar, eggs and that. A lot of this we can produce from our greenhouses. But we need normal flour as well. That requires wheat, barley, oats and sorghum. And I'll be looking around in that. And I notice I've got these. The micro greenhouses. I use these for the like, seeds and fries of pallets and that. Or the big bags, but these can also be placed down. So, you know, get a couple of these down. I'm not sure if I've got any other greenhouses, so open air garden, that. Nope. Potato processing, nope. Raven ports, nope. So, yeah, I think I'll get a couple of those down. But, yeah, first of all, I need to get this finished off. And then, yeah, any excess fertilizer. Oh, I may just start now because we've got like 40,000 litres left in storage at the main farm. And then, yeah, get every production purchased. And then, yeah, get these ways eradicated. <laughs>
that's our farm in that. And yeah, we've gone and quickly a pick up in that. Just so we can grab these eggs and that. And then we've got the XJ somewhere in that. But for heck it, let's quickly go in this one. Hop into here. I think we should have. Yeah, some more eggs over there. Yeah, only 2,000 litres though, so. Not sure what we're going to do, but anyways, we are ready to get purchase of all the productions. Also, I made a little bit of a cock up because I estimate the capacity of the dry corn in the bakery now, or the green mill, whatever it is. So, if you have a look, uh, no, not that one. Yeah, I accidentally sent all of our dried corn over, so. But yeah, anyways, I think we should have enough money anyway, so... Yeah, for now, we'll just keep that stored. So I also when we were needed, so... Ooh, the fine corn flour should be distributed. Please tell me I don't have any flour packs spawned up yet. Will it be here at the back? Actually, to be honest, I don't know. Got a fence over there, we can come in that way. Oh no, phew! <laughs> Nope, no pats has spawned yet, so I think now what we need to do is go and purchase every production. So we'll start off with things like the dairy and that. Because yeah, these are going to be key here. So 70 grand for you. We'll get milk transferred over. And to be honest, do we need cheese and chocolate? I'm not sure. I haven't looked at our other productions pre that, but apart from that, yeah, too many productions. I know chocolate's not required, but butter is, so. And yeah, butter is required for the cornbread. Yeah, for cakes, we're not doing cakes. We're not doing normal bread in that at the moment. But yeah, things like apple pie now to get underway, so. Yep, let's get that cracking on. Thankfully, we only need milk in that, so... Actually, we can get a load of milk transferred over, so... If I tab over to the right one... So yeah, we've got 20,000 litres here, and if we have a look at our animal pens... We've got another 1,000 litres of milk. But yeah, also, we need to start focusing on feeding the cows and that, and our other animals. Even though, yeah, we're going to be running serious to the end of the year now. I want to have enough food in that, so... Even we provide a, another year's worth of animal feed for the next person coming in. At least we have some crops now already sorted up. But yeah, let's go and take the milk over for a sec and get that going. And there we go, we're at the dairy plant, so I think <coughs> the milk input is over here. Yes, it is. So that's going to get cracking. And also, I'm thinking, do we need more milk in that? Because that took us a while to get all that milk in. Because, yeah, how many cows have we got and how many can we have? So, yeah, I think first of all, it's all about breeding the cows, but. To be fair. Yeah, we're making feet soon. And can I get off on just silage? No. Is either hay, which is 8%, which is for beef cows, not too, too bad, but for dairy cows, they do need that tea and more and that, so. But yeah, milk's on the way, that's going to last us nearly a month, so that'll get distributed all over and that, so split between the productions. But yeah, now we need sugar and that, because I've swapped some of the Omatana greenhouses, or added, sorry, things like sugar beet. Sunflowers and that. I'm tempted to get other things cracking in that, but to be honest, we're fine at the moment for the most part. So, yeah, I'm not going to really rush into anything. Money wise, I think, you know what? The cotton. I think we've got enough cotton for now, so the cotton we will set to sell, but yeah, grapes, corn, and that. Still processing. And yeah, also yeah, got strawberries being produced in that, just making sure 
I've got all the right things on. Yeah, pumpkins and all that, that's all been disputed. And I think we are good because, yeah, 34,000 litres anytime soon. But yeah, fucking find a way to get this converted into clothes and that, maybe. But yeah, I am sort of delaying things, so. Next, we need to go to the sawmill. And I'm not sure if we can actually sell these. It'd be good if we can, because I could use the one as part of the. Uh, I can't remember what pack it is now. I want it installed in that, so. We'll have a little look in a sec. Carpentry. So, yeah, wood goes in. Wood and planks goes in there. But yeah, it's going to be one of those productions where you can't really sell it. Oh no, you can, that's good. Lovely jubbly. Because, yeah, what I want to do is, if I go to the side... No, can't get rid of that. But yeah, we've got like, all these trees in there here we can use, so... Go into our Productions tab. And where is it? Not plan expansion. Even though I'm tempted by that. There it is, the American Sawmill. So we can get... Pretty much just wood, and we get your planks and beams and all that. All part of the Platinum Expansion, or Platinum DLC and that, so... Yeah, 70 grand or so, so... I'm just going to whack you down there. So yeah, there's no difference in between two, maybe in recipes and that, or ratios, but... Apart from that, it's not too bad, and... Actually, what I'm thinking is, if we go to our silos... It's alright, yeah, I've got strikes there, so... Yeah, I'm thinking place one of these down. 20 grand, so... Actually, I'm thinking... Yeah, heck, it puts some down here, maybe? Or over here and that, so... Input and output and that, so... I think something like that's going to do just fine. And then, whilst we're over here... Let's get these greenhouses down, so we can start making our grain and that. So we need the multi-crop greenhouses, left-hand side and right-hand side to large, so I'm thinking get a few of these down. It says it overlaps, but you know what, usually things like this are just free placing that. Actually, you know what, that I will be free placing, just because I can't be bothered to deal with all the landscape in that, so... Something like that. And yeah, it's got to be careful of our money, because I still need to get the other productions down. But I think that's going to be good, so... We have a little look, so... Open you up. And yeah, similar to the Umatana ones, we can get your root crops in that. Oils. And even core, <laughs> yeah, we don't need more cotton than that. Oh god, strawberries. But yeah, what we want is our grain. So we need manure, fertilizer, or these. But yeah, for now, I'm gonna set all these to distribute in. And yeah, I know we've got some already in the. Uh, process and stuff, so let me just get these all triggered in that. And then we'll go to our other productions. Gone 4 o'clock, and yeah, we spent a lot of our money. Yeah, this just a bit of a feed I could purchase, get the TMR production on the way. Because one thing I want to do is start doing the TMR in that, so... Yeah, we'll put this into, I think it's this one here is our TMR mixer. And yeah, I do apologize about the frame rate, it is quite a bit choppy in that. But yeah, I've gone and overspent our money on a lot of stuff. So, for example, I've got a plethora of lime here, which we can sell. Yeah, I bought like hundreds of thousands of liters, like 150 or so thousands of liters of lime. So, 
Yeah, I don't need that amount of lime, especially now we've got to worry about lime in the field, so... You know what? I'm going to get recuperate some of our money back by sending the lime. So yeah, that's doing that. Ah yeah, you can see we've got seeds, fertilizer and all that, so... I think what we'll do first of all... Okay, 46 grand for the lime, so... Then we've got our seed distributor over there. But one thing I'm worried about is topping up these, so... Okay, they're right, they're good in that. But what about the what these ones here? So, yeah, my problem is like they're going to fill up. So what I'm going to do is take the seed and all that over. And then from there, we will, I think, yeah, rest till about June. <laughs> That's a bit tell happy there, so yeah, let's head over to Sawmill Sec. Actually, you know what? Uh, screw it, we'll get rid of you. Go and grab you. And yeah, we'll take it over and then we'll see where we stand afterwards. So, Alright, yeah, I completely forgot about these here. These are the fill points. So yeah, I think the best thing to do is go and grab one bag at a time. How much does that take and require? Actually, we're having time for that. Let's go into here, so... Fertilizer in that, 4,000 litres. So yeah, one thing I think we can do is... We're going to put one of these down next to every greenhouse. And yeah, also I did make some changes of where we're making... If I show you... Pretty much we're making everything apart from the fruits and that, so... Oats, wheats and sorghum is going to get distributed. I'm not doing the fruits. Corn is being distributed on that one there. Now I need to stop checking that, so yeah. Sell sell, distribute, distribute the oils, sell the potatoes, and then distribute that, so, let me just quickly go over, yeah, that looks all good, also, we're going to get some sugar beet underway, so, yeah, we already have a little bit in storage, so that sugar is going to be useful for everything, but yeah, so I'm just going to quickly show you what we're doing here, come on, come with me, and yeah, we'll get all these topped up. And yeah, it's good. So that's 4,000 litres as well. Which it shouldn't take us all that long, actually. But regardless, we'll get all this done. And I'll see you folks in a bit once we're done this. And when we're moving everything over to these silos. And I think with the line, what we'll do is we'll just go and sell them, I think. There we go. Got everything transferred over, and now I'm just gonna put the rest of our stuff over here. And yeah, actually, to be fair, I should have did buy excess amounts of fertilizer and lime. Well, maybe a couple of packs here and there, but overall, it's not too bad. I'm rather than put them in over there, which I think you can actually. Because yeah, first of all, I was thinking, no, you couldn't do that, but apparently you can, so. Alright, let's go around this. Our fill point is on the left. And there we go. Seed and fertilizer is going in. Lovely jubbly. And now to sell the last bits of our lime. Alright, so we've got our lime and yeah, let's go and sell those. Let's get out of the way. So yeah, that was 19 grand, and I don't think that's going to be enough for another production, because, yeah, we've got the bakery net, corn, got the sugar mill, now we need the oil mill, so that is on this site, and yeah, it does require some money, so I uh, don't know why we had a free grand loan there. Shouldn't be having a free grand loan, but 
And the Houston get everything to get distributed. We'll turn these on, get those cracking back in. And then, yeah, I think, you know what? We're just going to sell these. Again, it's part of the conquering map and that, that sort of, yeah, a bit of an aspect to it all. Yeah, we purchase every land, but yeah, I want to own every production, so I think we're all good here. That's a sell point up there. Got that already. Old farm. Technically, do we own the BG? I can't remember. Do we own the biogas plant? No, we don't. So we need to purchase this. We need 300 grand. So, because yeah, we've got the green elevator and that. Yeah, we own that. So yeah, I got a couple of ideas, and that requires the usage of our new. Uh, and yeah, I want to borrow one of these. But I think they're gonna be like. 15 20 grand to yeah so heck it you know what let's go to the loan oh yeah i know we can get a massive loan that get the bloody let's go to 100 grand yeah get what we need but i want to do it a bit the fun way now rather than just getting loans and that all the time because yeah i think what we'll be doing anyways is skipping the heads but Yes, yeah, so I want to examine some of these trees and that. And to be fair, actually, I think a lot of these can be cut down with a tree harvester and that. But like the oaks and that, I think we're going to need to chop them down. Or, I think what we'll do instead, I can't remember if it's under forestry, under Platinum expansion. No, don't need the virus. We want the winches and that, so. Yeah, I think we'll want that. And we'll get a tree harvester and that, and I'll, I'll risk it. Go with the massive one. So, yeah, we've got this. This means we can do the biggest trees we can in Farm Sim. But yeah, at 5 miles an hour, it's going to take us while to go over there. Yeah, I think we'll need to release a new loader because this is going to drive me mad. So yeah, we'll release you. And get you loaded up. So right, we've got our train at. And I just realised the Phoenix, we got the winches and that, so... And I think they do heavier than that because... If we go to our own equipment... Yeah, 45 tons I could pull, compared to 8.6 tons, so I'm not sure if that's between the two inches front and rear, or just the one. Oh yeah, in you, we'll get you, play sound like so, extend the boards, I think we may want to extend that a little bit. Something like that. Turn the engine off. And now we'll get this baby loaded up. Get the tracks aligned. Which we're not even close. And yeah, I think what we need to do is unfold this. Get you on. Oh, this is so sketchy in that. There we go. And yes, we are on. And actually, you know what? We didn't need to extend it, but we did anyways. Now we want to fold said harvester. Lovely jubbly. Get you strapped down. Ramps. And now we'll head over to Ooh, tipping. The, uh, what's it? Forestry a little bit there. Yeah, forestry area. But yeah, one thing I also want to do before we leave the map and that, leave the series and that, is replant all these trees we've cut down that. So, I think we'll do that in the next episode or so. But, I think for now, we are looking good. And yeah, 
this is a lot better than four miles an hour. But even then, like, because of how far the trees are, it's maybe a little bit problematic. But yeah, we'll come across that bridge when we get there. So off we go. And yeah, I'm going to start with some of these trees over here. And I'm just going to open the help menu. I want 8 meter logs. Get you aligned. And yeah, that's going to be a problem. And I think, how do we drop this again? So. Circle to open a grab, so that's going to drop that. And then boom. Just cut all these logs down. And yeah, I think this is going to be the key to fund the BGA in that. Because we go, we can do as an option is do a bit of a rapid version of the processing. So, oh uh, yeah, go for all the greenhouses. But yeah, we can get your planks fast. Long planks fast, wood beams, prefab walls and that. And you know what? I was going to turn everything on. And I think, you know what, overnight, we're just going to sell everything. I know we can get a bit more of a profit now if we sell it ourselves, but... Yeah, to be fair... Yeah, it's going to make sense if we do it this way, so... I think it's better to do a bit of forestry in this episode now. I thought about yeah, purchasing this and that, but then just leaving it. But then realising we forgot to purchase the BG and that, so we need the money. Uh, yeah, so let me get this done. I may do a short time lapse here. And I'll see you folks afterwards once we're done here. some milk and that so we can get our cornbread making along with our pumpkin apple pies along with our sweet cornbread and yep so far it is all looking good also turn on our lorry not ready because yeah at the moment we're just over that 335 grand mark however what I'm going to do is go and sell these items and yep since I removed the CSZ pack, we will be purchasing this, so we want the take handle version. Just looking at the colour we got, so we can 
match these up, there's no issues whatsoever. I think it was something like a Lemkin Blue Nat. I don't know, something on those lines, so... Yeah, where are we to? We're over here. Lovely jubbly. Yeah, blue is bang on. Also, since we're here, going to grab our bait. 2.2 tons. That is just enough for us. It's not too much. Also, it's not too little, so... Let's head down to the sawmill and get everything loaded up. Enter hand earlier, so... Yeah, now all we need to do is go and grab these. Let's go that swing. There we go. And then, yeah, with that 2.2 ton weight, we can get all of these loaded up. And yeah, I'm thinking send it all to the sell every container or something like that. Ooh, careful. But yeah, we've got a ton of items and actually do we have any wood left over? No, we do not. But yeah, we've got a shit ton of items to sell, so bear me a sec whilst I get all these items loaded up. up at hand then so we do still have some pats left to be spawning but unfortunately we've hit the pad limit so we've got 10 more long planks and another two lots of prefabricated walls so yeah let's go into our prices and yeah i'm assuming everything's gonna be fine sending that seven container but i would see if there's any worth sending it elsewhere now so Prefab walls and that, so looking at the prices, so everything's actually the best price. So that is all the way down there. And the problem with this is we're stacking it this high. Like, really, I should have done this in two trips now, like cut in half, but oh well, screw it in that. And now let's go down here. There's literally just over there we need to go. Oh, yeah, that's the one is the tip it's over. So far, so good. I'm just sending it free wheeling down. Lovely jobby, there's a train. At least you don't have to worry about that, because God forbid if you got hit by a train with this loaded up. Oh, 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 it's tipping. I think it's just gently do it. Okay, train's gone. Oh no, no. Oh, we need to take a short turn. <laughs> oh, this is a very but <laughs> Yeah, my splinter is very. Not just boot it. Nope. <laughs> that did not work. One more try. Nope, nope. Do not tip for freaking out loud. That's it, counter it. That's it, good thing about having the Winter Wolf is it's got a ton of power. So, at the moment, we're on three, let's see, 327 grand. Let's see where we stand afterwards once we're sold with this. Because, yeah, we're going to get a lot of money for this. And, yeah, frame rate is starting to return. So yeah, we're at 327. Already we're hitting that half a mil. That's not even me, we're being it perfectly lined up, so bear with me a sec whilst I get the rest of the salt. That was definitely worth it. So we was at what 327 grand. Now we're at 603 grand, so I think we've hit the mark now for the yeah, I think we've hit the mark for the BGA, so go and get to this purchased. So now I can say we have purchased every production on the map, so... Okay, requires a lot of stuff. Really, it's going to be Surrey and... Yeah, Surrey and Manure and that. Should could be cut, we may do that, maybe. Silage, yes, we've got tons of silage ready but 
One thing I've noticed is our cows are just yeah, about to run a TMR. So yeah, we need to get the TMR underway. And yeah, that's going to take a hot minute, so... I think we're going to need to buy some straw gnats. Also, we need to do some mowing. So let's go and purchase the straw first of all. So, large stacks of straw. Nine thousand of your paddits. 30, 270,000 liters. Yeah, I'll say that'll be enough. Your ship, so... I have no idea how this is going to work in that. Oh, alright, we've got some bells. Oh, no, 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 don't tip. Ah, oh, no. That was my biggest worry of tipping, because now... I think what I need to do is drop you. Get ourselves corrected. Let the big bag of winch support. Do its own little thing. Nope. Ah, freak. That was my worry. Come on. Get 24 bells on or so, so... Let's go and pop this into our mixer. So, is that one down here or is it one up there? I think it's this one down here. Actually, no. This is the... Yeah, heat dryer, so... When we get some grass cutting out, yeah, that'll be fine. But yeah, we've got mineral feed in. We're gonna have to straw in. The only thing is to grass and silage in that, but I thought a solution for that, so go ahead and eat. So yeah, now just back it up. Now I should take all of our straw. I hope. Nope, it ain't. Why not? Come on, just take the straw, please. What is wrong with this? I thought it would load up. Look fine, but nope. Ah, wait a minute. If it goes on the ground. Then they're in. Yeah, so who's throwing it on the ground? Ah, yep, yeah, you know what? It's actually working. So, now, have I got too much straw? And the answer to that is a big fat yes, but I did. So, there we go. Get the side put in. No, these aren't lift or anything like that, so... Nope. Oh, great. Why does everything just go... <laughs> uh, not to plan, I thought. Yeah, just smack them off. It'll be fine, but I guess probably not, so... Let's move you out of the way, and yeah, I know we can cut grass and that, and get some hay or stall grass to ferment. Not to ferment, uh, to... To use that. Is that working out? There we go. So I to make up his freaking mind. So yeah, what I'm going to do is we need some team more badly. So let me just go and purchase some um, grass bells. Is it? No, a bell. Sorry. Got all the bells over now, and yeah, we are churning out that TMR, So. We look at our cows. They still got a little bit left now, enough for a couple more hours than that. But yeah, one thing I also forgot was I know we had a bunch of bells in this building over here. So how many bells do we have? Actually, a lot of it is just grass bells. So hmm, I got an idea. So. Yeah, a bunch of sage bells, so... You know what? Screw it. Let's put a bunch of these in the BGA, shall we? Oh, a little bit of a lag, lag spike there. And, yeah. 
yeah, <laughs> just froze her for me, it did. Froze my character in spot, so let's go and get those put into the BGA. Because, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I didn't think it was going to have spare signage. But, yeah, yeah, I completely forgot we had all of this, so yeah, we'll get those and then the square bells and that. Yeah, that may be for a later date. Ah, so you know what? You know what's just happened? Just had a fucking game crash and all the progress we've made has gone to absolute jack squat. So, well, I made some progress in that. It's just things with the mixers and that, the mixed wagons and all the animal stuff. And I think that's including, yeah, the of the pallets, the milk and that. So all this, that we've just done in, what, last half an hour or so. It's now gone to absolute pot, so... Yeah, I'm thinking, yeah, I'm getting a bit tired now off this, so... I think that's where I'm going to leave it today. So, yeah, overall, we've achieved what we need to do. We've gone and purchased every production. And actually, you know what? Just for the sake of it... Let's go into our Productions tab. And let's just set... Yeah, it's not got so many Productions. Let's go to your. There we go, yep. Getting the correct Production. And you know what? These items, we're just going to sell as they are, so... Sell, sell, and sell. Sell the wood chips, screw it and that. So yeah, we'll skip ahead till 10 o'clock. Actually, before we do that, let's go and purchase the BGA. Once again, so that is just over here. 300 grand. Oh yeah, we'll have it all on. Oh yeah, what I'll do in between episodes is, yeah, I'll get it all sorted. Yep, yeah, back up to 270 grand. But yeah, I'll get the side transferred over, I'll get the animal feed doing in that. And yeah, I think next time, we'll see in June, I think, get the grass cut. Because yeah, I think next episode's got to be, what, the penultimate episode in that? Because yeah, just looking at our crop windows in that. Barley's ready to harvest. And looking at our crops in that, look at the grown stages. They are all looking good, so yeah. Overall, we've achieved a lot on that, and yeah, I'm speaking a lot about the series and that. But yeah, maybe a, a little short break of about half a week or so. Because yeah, over the weekends, this is going to come out on Saturday morning, maybe, or late Friday night. But yeah, we'll start on the new Let's Play. Comparing uh, countryside, that I don't know what to do at the moment. But yeah, this new 10,000 Dairy Challenge. I would really get cracking on that, so I'd spend Friday night getting that recorded. And also finishing off the mod review from Thursday and that, because yeah, those 60 buildings do take a while to do. But anyways, that's what I'm going to leave it today. And as always, hope you enjoyed the episode. If so, smash that button, feel free to comment down below. If you want to share something, please be my guest. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, then please consider. But for you to do, hope you nice day. But for now, it's me, Farmer Ever Extreme, and I'll see you all very soon.